In this example, we'll make a drawing, a uh, sample mini drawing from this part. Uh, we'll go to the file, make drawing from part, select a template, and then we'll drag our X, Y view, uh, which in SOLIDWORKS is our front view, onto the drawing sheet. And what we'll do is uh, we'll go into the properties here and set the sheet scale to 1 to 30. And uh, this should be good. Uh, we'll insert a table of pieces. And we have a couple options here. We'll show both. Uh, the piece table will bring in the piece number, name, and material. And what I can do is delete the materials uh, from this example. Delete column. OK. And the uh, table features work in conjunction with uh, balloons. So here I'll add piece balloons. And we'll balloon all these pieces. And these work the same as SOLIDWORKS balloons. Um, the exception that these can be used with surface bodies. And it's taking the exact flat name for the piece. OK, and to clean this up, we'll insert a magnetic line. And make these look nice. All right. Um, so at this point, uh, we could also use uh, piece callouts to add the name directly to the piece. Uh, here we'll use the piece name. And we'll use the no leader option. And we can just drop the name right on the piece. And if you remember back to when we were using Piece Creator, uh, these names were automatically created. Uh, there's also some tools to help automatically create names that conform um, to your business convention. Uh, at this point, what we'll do is just print it. And uh, we'll save it as a PDF. Oops, wrong scale. We'll print it and here we'll use uh, 11 by 17. There we go and we'll save this as a PDF.